welcome back to another episode of We are going to take a minute and drink because we are in the desert and it's healthy. Ah, so much better. Now, let's get into that dungeon. I hope that we can survive that. Uh, anyone else that talked over here? Yada yada yada. Wave hand hello. Yada yada. Uh, when I do have equipped uh, under books too. Wait, wait. Something, something here. Yeah, cards listed under books. Uh, not all cards are equipable cards, I think. Yeah, they seem to have the same problem as I have with that. Weird. Whatever. Uh, let's get in the dungeon of the Morai Ruins. Do this in hard mode, why not? Better chance for getting better items. Go. The traces of black magic still remain everywhere in Morai Ruins. Oh, it gets dark yet again. How nice. Oh no, I can't see even an inch in front of me. It's too dangerous to go any further. Please wait. Let me light a torch. Maybe some magical light. Light of Regulus, Lord of all gods. This should help us see the path. Eleven. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's hurry and search the ruins. Those ruins seem also. Whoa, what is that? Really? Again? Ah. Whew. That was a close one. We better watch our step. I just hope that that was no Marco Cosi. This glyph seems Wait. to respond to life. I want to know what this dude says. I'm kind of getting drawn through here. A bit too quickly, though. Don't like that. So, do we have anything else up here? No. Read the words written on the rack. Oh, that doesn't look good. Hmm. We will find great treasure. Only the light of Genesis can extinguish the darkness. What could this mean? It means we need a stronger battery. There must be a way forward. That breeze, it's coming from those rocks. The ruins must be through there. I can make a path. Isn't this a nice way to introduce dungeon? Oh. Seems to be inhabited. All right. Cursed. What did this to them? Wait, there's two more to go. Where are the other two? Oh, that's strange. Whatever. Uh, jump on the wall? No. Social ruins? Uh oh. Will he be? Oh no. Nah, he will be all right. Far too many of them. He's a demon. He can't do I'll find this. Find another way. Go on. 
Hmm. Or I just shoot upwards. That could have helped as well, right? No reason to split up. Bam. Asomo. This area looks very suspicious. Ah, no. The flamethrower is on cooldown. Not what I want anymore. Oh, oh. Okay, I definitely need to suck up on health potions. Don't want to die here. Usually I tend to play a priest character that is able to heal themselves. Sadly, the character that's able to heal in here is a paladin, and uh, I tend to dislike paladin. Or at least the base class is a warrior class, and I uh, don't play those types of classes very often. It just doesn't really resonate with me. <laughs> Same actually goes for the gunner, but this one has a flamethrower, so... That's an exception made here already. Right. Uh, no, I just wanted to look for Mokokos this time. No need for Mokokos. Work done. Yeah. Let's just lure all of them together so I can kill them in an instant. Be really careful now. Oh no, they also have ranged attacks. I hate that. So does it give us the water? No. Yes. So maybe there's a certain air bubble around this, these whole ruins. That might be it. Oh, oh, last one didn't hit. Seem to be rushing through my health potions far too quickly. Alright, come on. How many more are there? I'm gonna defeat all of them again. Okay, now I get it. So if I set this up, I need to keep them in check and therefore I'm gonna use a back attack like that one or something else that's able to stun the enemies for a certain amount of time. That's perfect. And up we go. And sideways we go again. And uh... Wait a minute. Oh, it goes this way. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's no back and forth jumping sometimes. Oh, damn. Yeah. There we go. Second water blockade. Okay. And there's number three. Ooh. What did I say about the enemy coming out of the huts being a very nice way of spawning them? Very nice. Very nice new guy. Maybe 
Maybe I should use the uh, AOE if I keep it more. Oh, wait a minute. Fuck myself a hidden area. Nice. Huh. One more Goku seat. That's it. Come on. There has to be more here. There always is. Well, not so much. That's the only one that I've found so far. There's probably more down there, but... Ah. I said I didn't want to look after those... Mokokos. Because they have a very, very annoying way of being played. Okay, there's also some guardians. Some other creatures. I, 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 I. Okay, let's see all of them together somewhere. Okay, darn it. All the round we go. Of course, that's not very easy. There we go. Now oh, they're trying to become loose. The rocket launch is more a boss killer than a good killer. It's much better if you can hit a specific target when you send very close to it. Because then the chance for one of those rockets to miss is lower. I'm using too much health potions. I need to be really careful. Now I'm at uh, 30 and I need to stock up until I reach hundreds again. Maybe I need to fight those enemies in a different kind of way. Maybe I have to change the way the skill points are. Ooh. Play side. Come on, kill. There we go. Ah, uh, you can't get anything from there. <laughs> There's just a few seconds of health potion regeneration. You can activate. Then nothing. Ah. Oh, 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 it again. Wrong button. Oh, please don't make the thing fall. No, 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 no. What's that? Oh, spikes. Traps. No. At least it kind of gives it away. Once it starts wiggling, there's a few seconds afterwards when this... Is there a pattern? Like, each alternate thingy goes poof. Okay, it goes down, it wiggles, nothing, and it goes poof. Wiggle and poof. Wiggle and poof. So once you know it wiggles, you have to go to another plate that's not wiggling. The timer might be the same on everyone. So let's try to get uh, across here like so. Ah, like that one. Ah, that one. No, that's not good. Oh, wait. Shite. That's not good. Ooh. Okay, that was a bit iffy. Uh, definitely not cool. Pass through the thorny traps. <laughs> or like, get hit by the thorny traps. 
take all of the damage from the thorny traps. Wait, how many more health potions do I have? 200 and... I have so many health potions. Okay, I don't need to concern myself with that. I have tons of them. As long as I can press the heal button in time, I'm gonna be okay. All right. Do I fight this one together with a group of enemies? One. All of them. Okay. Can you just cycle the, around them? Like a wolf circling the sheep. Uh, that was not intended. Whoa, that's the second wave. Oh, that sheep, come on, get killed. Okay, got that. Do they respawn? I hope not. No, 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 no. Not what I wanted. Okay, almost got that. Almost got it. I mean, they just stand there and don't do anything. I think that boss guy actually triggers them one after another. And on top of that, you can trigger it yourself as well. Once you kill the boss, all of the ants are also gone. Right. Well then, wait. Nah, this is the evasion pop up that happened again. So, pass through the thorny thingy, and what do we get? Nothing that is better than the items that I have at the moment. Of course not. No. Oh. God, no. Like, there is a plate on the floor. Maybe you can trigger that or whatnot, but it's just weird. So how does that work? Okay. So it's always a space of two of them. Uh, oh. Like, look at this plate. It's so suspicious. Why? Why can't you just do something with that plate? That's so weird. And why can't I find any Mokoko seeds? It's even weirder. Oh, no. Aha. No damage for you. Whoa, 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 whoa. Two, all of them together. This is a strange extrusion kind of thing. And there's a hidden room with uh, a microcosy, as usual. Bleh. Come on! Just let me pick this up first. Oh, there's two! And they're extremely dark, so you can't even see them no matter what. Like, why have Mokoko seeds if the color doesn't matter? If the place, like, that. again, I'm extremely whiny about it. I can't stress this fact enough. It's a very, very shitty collectible. Uh.
Actually, do I get experience from fighting them? Yes. Just don't know how much though. This is two? Two experience for every uh, one of those enemies, so it doesn't matter. The only enemies that do matter are bosses. Same is true for dungeons. Sad. Ah, that one is special. Well, it was special, but right? Yeah. All right, that should be enough. So, question Is this a shortcut or not? Could be one. Let's just go down there then. So let's just look at that. Oh no, you can't jump down, but you have to jump up again. So there's one of the Mokokos. So weird. You don't find the Mokokos lying on the floor anymore. Wait a minute. Where did these enemies actually come from? Do they come out of an opening? Do they get machine? Like, look at that. Or maybe they came from the pot. No. Where'd they come from? They had to get spawned in from somewhere, right? time when you actually have to destroy a wall like that. Needy. Wait. I can trigger stuff. And where do we go? Uh, this one goes over here, then we go over here, and then further to the north. Yep, that might be it. Yes, we... Ah. Do we... Uh, yes. Thank goodness it stops on its own. Yeah, too many, too many, too many, too many, too many, too many. Oh, come on, that's shit, that's shit, that's shit. Oh, that's bullshit. Uh, bollocks. Uh, I hate that. Okay. Instant uh, resurrection. Let's see what this one does. Did I, uh... I mean, I did use something. I don't know what I actually use. <sighs> Quest. This one does do it, right? Move. Okay. It's annoying because I was stuck right next to another enemy and I couldn't move. Couldn't go sideways, couldn't do anything. Absolutely not cool. So, what that means is I can't just rush through here because I can stuck. Yeah, I can get stuck on enemies. Maybe even because it's a um, it's a staircase, that might be a thing. The staircase thing is definitely not cool. Alrighty, slowly but surely, slowly but surely. First step, actually. At least you don't have to uh, start this off from the get-go. Only thing is, um, I don't know what I used. Because it didn't look like a Phoenix Blue. 
it looked like something completely different. So... Let's take the turn to read this one. Uh, Ramella's Mirror. Ramella, a covetous queen of Encavian dynasty, ordered her men to bring a mirror that would reflect her beauty. The shaman came to the capital city of Morai. The mirror he had was finished with glittering ornaments, creating mystical ambience. Weirdly enough, the mirror was covered by a small piece of fabric. The mirror is for the queen. It's not farthest to see. When the queen took off the fabric, she nearly fainted. Locks of her hair started falling down to the floor, her skin wrinkled like that of an old woman in her deathbed. The king, furious at this queen's tragedy, tried to punish the shaman, but he had already disappeared with an eerie laughter. Beauty is not something that lasts. Why do you need a mirror then? You can't see yourself in the truest sense. Ha <laughs> Shaman of Darkness, Riffale. Still kind of an ass move. Okay, so that's the way forward then. Still so not used to G. I have to maybe really put this on a different button altogether. Right, and I can't even go through an opening that they creatures just made. Makes sense, makes sense. Whoa. Who's that? If this dwellers have invaded, find them. As you command, I smell them. <laughs> Where? Where? Find the trespassers! Find them! They're here! Hmm. Easy mode. And... Flaming! So, uh, that is still not the end boss yet, so... No, come on. Okay. I tend to mix up the movement and interaction key in here. Uh, it's definitely not helpful. And defeat it. Right. So, what do we get? Uh, a nice Forgotten King's chest piece. Everything tends to turn red now. Like, look at that. Uh, actually, no, the King's chest piece looks much more different than the stuff in the, in the trousers. Wait a minute. Uh, da, 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 this one. Hawkers outdated enhanced pants. Mm hmm. Interesting. Stylish, though. Definitely stylish. And isn't this the single most reason why you pick up good gear? <laughs> because of that. Okay, let's change this to another button. Ah, I kind of goes on my nerves to press G. This button is too far away. Um, there's your controls. Interaction. Ah, it's locked. So stupid, so stupid, so stupid, so stupid, so stu- foo, 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 Ah. Why can't you just change that? Why not? Why are there lock buttons here? It's G. G is the single most useless kind of button that you could have picked for that. An H interaction number two, right? Like, come on. Now, so far, I, I wonder, want to have a mouse button for that. Okay, what about macro? Macro text, uh, chat key settings. No, don't want a macro text. 
what I want is a macro that just does the G instead. Well, I could use a macro on the mouse and trigger that on its own. That would make things a bit easier. That's not usable. Gameplay control. Others, like zoom in, zoom out. Like, what purpose does it have to have things locked? I mean, the interaction button does not come up a second time in here. There's no reason to. Uh, maybe with Alt and G for the communication in here, but that one doesn't matter. It's just really weird. Why can't you change certain buttons? That makes no sense. Uh, why must it be G? Why couldn't it be E or F or at least R? Look like a Mokoko. Hey, no, right. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. They just continue to attack, or do they just come down there? There we go. Down the staircase at one point. Come on. There we go. So, anything special up there? Of course not. Inventory says we have a decent amount of room left. Map says we are really close to the boss. Hmm. Oh. Health bar says we need to heal a little, a little bit. It kind of feels as if the health potion gets cancelled the moment you take damage. Is there additional text in here? Consumes before tradable? No. Limited to five used in certain areas. <laughs> uh, I mean, I can use thousands of them. Cannot be dismantled. Sure. Exchange the potion merchant. It says exchange. Kind of feels as if this is the only way to get those things. Well, I not get it, but uh, well, I sell it. That main uh, uh, emination. That animation was pretty sweet. Okay, we don't go through that. We uh, make ourselves a little bit of room. They get staggered immediately. That's kind of cool. All right. What kind of button do I want to uh, exchange this thing with? I mean, that's one, two, three, four. Yeah, I could definitely exchange all of those. I have no use for the potions, but F one is such a strange button to press. Try the large attacks. I think I'm gonna try the large one first. And then I'm gonna see how much damage I can do. It's 
So, but first we have to let it attack us. We need to let it do some attacks first. Uh, maybe let it do some AoE or some. Oh, yes. There we go. Actually, I just activate it. Oh, come on, that's a sec. What is this? Dramatic entrance. Come on. I'm the MC, not you. Uh, what is this thing? That demon is cloaked in darkness. We must uh, pierce the darkness with light. Free laser beams for free Come hearts? <laughs> Almost got it. Okay. All immunity is done now. Oh wait, not cool. So the mirrors up here. Oh, come on, it's the outside of it. Okay, come on, let it do one more AOE. Nah, whatever. You need to be more careful when I'm going to trigger the jump. Now is the time. Reflect light onto Thanatos by using the gold mirror in a sunny spot. Mm -hmm. Destroy his dark energy. Yeah, now what? Uh, oh, click to aim. Like you need to get the rough uh, distance, and that's it. That's pretty alright. Uh, let's just try this a uh, <laughs> third time, why not? Doesn't work like that. Well, to get the last jump. Righty. Now. Flamethrower! Not cool. Cheat me! Whoa! Okay. Um, rule for the future, uh, always stand right next to the enemy. Just okay. Ah, bollocks! As long as you don't stand in there, once it gets triggered, everything is fine. Where is that? There's the mirror. Anyway, as long as you don't stand in there, once the damage triggers, you can go inside the area of effect after it's done, but the animation is still happening. It's kind of weird. Oh. What a nice floral tile. It's the first key to the Ark. The sword seal. It's not a bit too I'm easy. All this time. Lady. Oh. Shouldn't I get like, uh, I don't know. Oh, bollocks. Good job. 
But I'll be taking the seal from here. Watch out! Using your own body as a shield. <laughs> Foolish. <laughs> Not bad for a half-breed demon. But this is as far as you go. The sword seal. <laughs> One last time. <laughs> you pretend to be human, but this is the real you. That seal is mine. <laughs> Just a delay. Hmm. Hey, they're gone. How convenient. Let's pick up the seal before it's gone. Also. Maybe there's some more. Ooh, loot, yes. Uh, okay, so we get the seal first, and then we get the loot, it seems. There we go. Emote prey. Ooh. That's neat. All right, Ru ruins is not done. That means I can uh, do some report missions with thunder. Open the lovely chest, uh, exuding magic energy. And we got stuff. A whole lot of it. Now, which one is better? How many more necklaces do we have? Can we get only one? Hmm. Our neck is not large enough to handle more. Right. Need to maintain slightly smaller amounts of items. Let's see. I could dismantle everything. Uncommon and rare, and dismantle auto. Whatever auto dismantles it is. What is this? Um, auto dismantle item when acquired. Oh, so it does not even get in here. That's cool. Oh, that. Oh, that is cool. All right. Now we only have the good stuff remaining. Perfect, 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 perfect. So, let's have a quick look around. Because of the uh, oh, hideous, hideous, hideous microphones. There might be one, maybe two, somewhere around here, hidden behind an obstacle. Maybe even in plain sight, somewhere <laughs> down here or so. I mean, it would be really annoying if they would be right behind one of those pillars. You can't see them. Maybe down there on the throne to the left, to the right. Uh, nope. Behind that thing here that you can't see at all. Alright. There's, there's nothing here. Maybe an invisible wall that you can go through or whatnot. Wait. Uh, okay. So, we just need to get out of here and talk to Thunder again. Where were the ruins? Down here, Mubai. Oh, so there are easy dungeons and there are maybe slightly difficult uh, dungeons, larger dungeons. This is one of those larger dungeon symbols. Very interesting. Four out of 11. Hmm. Could still be much better. Watch out for the cliffs. The Yudia Desert is located on a highland. Ah, oh, welcome back. Hmm. hmm. You don't look hurt. Well, I am not hurt. I'm glad you came back safely. I saw a column of light shoot from the Mirai ruins towards Ojorn Hill, and that has me worried. The priest who was with you disappeared with a demon he was fighting. 
Oh no. Let me read this fortune right now. Give me a moment. Uh, north Redland, it's a Sean Hill. There's another shaman named Foxfire there. You should go ask her for help. I've heard Foxfire is there to resolve some mysterious phenomena on the hill. Ask the people there, they'll know where he is. Oh. Please send my regards to Foxfire. So it's a dude. Right, so let's uh, do any mode. I only know free report people yet, so we should be good. 51 only, what is going on? That's absolutely nothing. It says 250 report, but we don't get anything. Or maybe it's like the first 100 plus 50 on the next stage. That might be it. Anything on here? Nothing. Pride home report things that I could give available amount 30. Well, actually, wait a minute. Available amount. No, I only have one of those. So why does it say available amount 30? Does it say that once I hit 30 in my inventory, I can't get any more of those? That's strange. I'm not going to give that. Okay. Wait a minute. Go to Ozone Hill. But I wanted to check out this uh, northern area there. I don't know what that is. What about that? Used to obtain 1,000 silver. That's 18,000 mm -hmm, silver. It's a gold coin. Can't I just convert it into a gold coin? I don't want to turn it into silver. Uh, Alright, let's just uh, move around here. Maybe. What the? Thanos core. Liver. Yeah, Liver Thanos core. A peculiar thing happens in Aragel's soul. Uh, salt plains after a rain. When the clear reflection of the sky fills the puddles of rainwater, bluish substances are found floating in the air, followed by appearances of giant ma of a giant made of salt. An adventurer named Liver Thanos went out on multiple expeditions to investigate this. After he witnessed a scene during an expedition, however, he left Yudia stricken with horror. A blue, blue core was sucking in the salt to produce demons. You have to get far, far away. Levatanos rushing out of Yudia. Right. And... This thing here... Yeah, it's a, it's a continent-specific stuff. That's nothing to do with the area that we are in at the moment. <laughs> None of them are anyway special. Okay. Some of them have, let's say, bonus of. Oh, wait! Um, I have this, uh, this prayer thingy that I can learn, sure. It's one thing that we can get good at. And then there is. Pray, that's the new one, so what does it do? Oh, I could use it for like and subscribe. That's a good idea. That is perfect. It's just a wee bit slow. That's it. Now, uh, alpha bandits can be triggered and waiting insects with. Uh, 4 out of 25, that's a very long time. That's only 4, that's okay. And didn't I find one out of ten? Jeez, that's all. But I want to trigger this one, Waiting Insect Rift, which is... Oh, where is this one? Not in this area. Or Jean Hill. Oh, okay. That's perfect. So, why would you go... Up on here. Oh wait, that one looks special. If uh, 
Alright. At least get the ones with the buffs on their heads. That's it. Sometimes there's the uh, boss monster marker. Sometimes it's just the buff marker. The buff markers are kind of where it's at. So. This is northern section supposed to be useful for. Uh, maybe find something to interact with. Like, uh. Nomad Del Rope. Wait. Did we ever do a mission for this guy? Oh, wait a minute. There, we found something. There we go. Entry for. But That's pretty much it. Ooh. That part right here that's seeing is suspicious. Uh, it doesn't matter where we go. We can just walk straight through. There's no teleporter right next to the exit. Like convenience things. Come on. A teleporter right next to the exit. That would be pretty much a must for everything. So, what about durability? Uh, we still have a decent amount that we can manage. Can it be that jewelry doesn't have durability stats it's uh and gear wait gear does have durability jewelry does not uh but normal gear does have for some reason that's strange maybe jewelry can also break but just not at the beginning of the game maybe i only found one seed up here uh Try to make things much nicer now, as so I don't have to scan the area like an idiot. Hmm. And there we have our little exit to the Ozone Hills. Before we go there, and probably trigger another cutscene unwillingly, we're going to end this episode, which was, um, well, the first introduction to more difficult enemies. Until next time, then, like and subscribe, of course. And I said I wanted to make the prayer thingy, but... Nah, it just takes so long. Uh, until next time then. Ta-ta.